Welcome back. We're joined by Neve Sharkey, lead singer, Eleanor Rogers, rhythm guitar, uh, backing vocals. Uh, mm, oh, gosh. She, oh, yeah, Jenny McKeown is not here, as you say, but we've got Sarah McLaughlin and Darren Farley, and they're all members of a band. And I'm joined now by some of the members of this very popular Drada based all girl group featuring X. That's what they're called, featuring X. And the group formed back in 2011, and they've been described as the future of Irish indie rock music. Oh, gosh. Uh, they have teamed up with an organization called ReachOut.com and have released a video aiming to help young people going through tough times in their lives. Joining me now are members of that band. You're all very, very welcome, girls. Thank you very much. Thanks. Lovely to have you back on the program. Um, tell me a bit more about how the group first started back there, what, three or four years ago? Um, well, yeah, it was transition year, so we were in Green Hills, which we've just graduated from yesterday. Um, yes, well, we uh, formed a band in transition year, and since then we have been gigging and enjoying the music career. You started off as a Thin Lizzy tribute act, though, didn't you? Uh, well, no, more so we formed the band, and then the band kind of joined with other girls in our year, and we did a Thin Lizzy tribute. It was for a competition. competition. Yeah. You write most of your own material? Yep. Uh, yeah, we're um, mix of covers, mix of you know originals. We have an EP out, but we still perform with some covers. So it's just because during the leaving, sir, it's kind of a bit hard to kind of write at the minute. But uh, during the summer, we're we're back to writing, and we're gonna have hopefully by the end of summer a whole set of originals. Did you say your last day at school was yesterday? Yeah, yeah. <gasps> finished sixth year. Oh God, well somebody must love it because she's still in her school uniform. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I slept in it. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, no, it's I was just studying in school. <laughs> Yeah, because Leaving Cert is up and coming in a couple of weeks' time, isn't it? Two weeks. Two weeks today. So. Yeah. Now, we'll get back to that <laughs> subject in just a few moments. But tell me, what have you been doing since transition year 2011, since you formed the band? You've, you've been to a number of high um, identity gigs, haven't you? Yeah, we played Electric Picnic last summer. Who's talking there? Right into the microphone. There you go. Sarah, hello. <laughs> we played Electric Picnic last summer. Um, and how did that go? Yeah, it was really cool. It was good fun. We played the two sets and uh, it was amazing. Amazing experience. It was really... It was kind of a bit crazy because we just started off as just this band who just performed and just in our band room and then it just kind of, I don't know how, oh, it was crazy. It escalated very quickly. Yeah. I, I mentioned Thin Lizzy Tribute Act, but you, you are fairly loud in rock, aren't you? Um. <laughs> you'd, be, you'd be a rock band now. You wouldn't be singing okay, yeah, I mean, carols. That's what you want to call oh, it. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, well, I've got, no little, hymns I've got a little sample here of a thing called, uh, oh, God, you can tell me what this is. I think this is called uh, Too Many Times. One Too Many, many times. times. Yeah, that's a quick listen to this if we can. Can we have a listen to that? Can we? No? Right? We'll yes. Try this one here. Yes. Yeah, we'll, we'll, uh, yeah. Ah! Said they were loud.
You're tapping away nicely to that one, girls. Uh, that's a song called Too Many Times. Was that a studio recording or is that something you just brought in for us especially? Oh, yeah, well, that's off our debut EP. We recorded it last year. Oh, um, good, yeah. yeah. In Kildare, in New Moo Productions. Yeah. Now, you've teamed up with ReachOut.com to help other young people. Firstly, tell us a bit more about ReachOut.com. Um, well, Reach Out is an organisation. Uh, they have a website and they have other uh, forums that they have online and um, in person. Um, it's basically there to advise and help uh, young people on the daily struggles of life. And as a teenager, and kind of like to help them along like that to show that um, that every it happens to every teenager that people can kind of help each other. Like the health, yeah, yeah, advice and support. So. And how did this co collaboration with ReachOut.com? How did it come about? Uh, ReachOut approached us, and they heard about the band, and they knew we were our age, so we're eighteen, which was inappropriate. And they thought we'd be kind of relatable to kind of to the to people, younger people, to the people who would be on the website. And also, we've kind of been through that teenage um, phase already, so. We have a lot to look back on and kind of give our opinions on. Now, you've released a video in collaboration with ReachOut.com. It's called uh, Tough Times. Yeah, uh, we did um, just there before Christmas. We did um, a video with them um, on uh, different topics about teenage life. So how we deal with school, how we deal with stress, stress, uh, the friends. pressures, friends. Um, all like everything really and um, it'll all be released over a series of episodes so the first one was re released there a little so, while so ago. It's, it's a bit like a soap opera specifically aimed at young people who might have encountered problems and you would be able to like no just like an interview it's kind of us talking about our experiences and opinions and whatnot yeah it's kind of yeah it's just kind of like questions it's not it's more just uh, the interviewer they're asking and then we kind of answer just openly Okay, tell me, tell me, how can people access the video, by the way? Um, it is online on Reach Out's YouTube channel, um, and you, the link will be on our Facebook, Twitter, and so on. As well as preparing for the Leaving Cert, which is on in a couple of weeks' time, sorry to remind you again, but um, um, you're about to release a new single uh, called Wild Love. Yeah, yeah. Um, we intend on releasing that at the beginning of, the, of June this year, so um, yes, we're looking forward to it. And I would imagine your your your, your parents. How, how did your parents react to you spending uh, so much time with the band? What you were 12, 13, 14 when you started. Now you're doing a leaving cert. I would imagine that after the public examinations, a lot of you will be going to college. Will be will you be keeping up with the band, or will oh, you be yeah, doing it? Of course, definitely. definitely. Yeah. Yeah. It's more than a hobby at this stage. It's not like what we were like when we were younger. It's more. We actually love doing it and we love like progressing in our music and just writing music and kind of performance. It's not, it's it's changed since we were younger. Okay, well you're doing Leaving Cert and, and depending on the results you'll be going to college and, and which one. Have you any idea what, what professionally you'd like to pursue other than music? Well, we're all kind of, you know, hoping to get different courses in college, but at the same time keep up with the music. Like keep playing in the band while we're... Oh, I know that, but what kind of... Uh, oh, like actual degrees. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm doing film myself in Dunleary. Um, yeah. I'm hopefully going to do science in DCU. Um, like languages or law. Um, and I hope to do law in DCU. Right, but you'll be going to different colleges. How will you keep the, it's the, a, it's the, actually the, the togetherness of the band? Well, we have a good base as it is now because we all live in Drada or roundabout, so we're safe enough with that. And we still have, I think most of us will have they our weekends. They might even be going, like three of these girls here, they actually might be going to DC if they get the points. So that's the three of them all together. Yeah. Myself, Dublin. And it, it could be even handier because a lot of our gigs are Dublin based or, and require travel from here. So if we're up in Dublin, it's almost maybe yeah. handier. Well, the best of luck, girls. Uh, people can catch you because you have a gig coming up in June in Drada. Where's that? In McPhail's. On the 19th of June. 23rd. Okay. <laughs> and when, when do the public examination start? The 4th. 4th of June. So you'll have two weeks of that and then you'll probably celebrate on the 19th by, by going all wild in McPhail's. Yeah. Woohoo! Yeah, right up, right up. Right. Well, best of luck with the band and it's called Featuring X. And if you wish to download the video, it's called, uh, the website is called reachout.com and you can get the single Why Love from June the 4th. Yeah.
Pre-sale. through iTunes and the usual channels girls collectively thank you both uh, all of you very very much indeed and in her absence Jenny McKeown we're thinking of you and you're <laughs> studying hard no doubt mid-morning 